I want to show you how I can quickly produce an NWC file, a Navisworks cache file from within Revit, which is something I'll use uh, to compile larger models. So I'm going to open a, a project. This is the Frank Lloyd Wright Zimmerman house, but this is it in the preliminary design phase. Um, and it's actually very different from what the final building looked like. But the point of this is to show you that uh, what you can do is, looking at my uh, Revit content, I want to point out a couple of things. Is I've got a bunch of 3D views, and these can be taken into, will become part of my, uh, my Navisworks project, so that I'll have uh, cameras or viewpoints, as Navisworks referred to them, that look at the building. Um, I won't get things like... Uh, the renderings that are a part of of uh, Revit, but I'll be able to create um, rendering from within Navisworks very, very quickly and very easily. So, if I just uh, go back to here, the sequence to get something into an NWC format is to open a 3D view. Right, you can open any of those. Um, I'm just going to go to the standard 3D view because I want to do it from scratch. And I can see all of my objects in here. So what I would do is, if I don't want an object that's in here, I would go to view graphics and I would uh, put it, I'd remove the check mark, say from opposite the topography. And then when I export, these are just model lines, the topography or the surfaces are gone. When I export, I'm getting just what is in my view. So I'm going to control Z to get back to where I have everything. Now, when you, when you load uh, Navisworks after you've got Revit on your machine, under the, manage, uh, under the uh, tabs here, you'll see that you get an add-in option. And uh, if you go to the external tools, you'll see that you've got the option. This is really export to Navisworks 2012. And this is the Navisworks switchback that I mentioned earlier that lets you come and go between products. But here, what I'm going to do is pick on Navisworks 2012. Um, under the folder here, you see that I can, uh, it, it's offering me the NWC, Navisworks cache file, and the name of the file. So what I'm going to do is replace the one that was already there, just so you can see I'm, I'm overwriting it and replacing it. Um, and that, I'm actually done, that's it. That's I've taken all my content from a Revit model and I've put it into an NWC file. I'm now going to just close uh, Revit and I'm ready to continue.